When we return, Stephanie Kalsavich and Aaron Parcham, a young team that's already made an impact with the 2000 U.S. Junior Champs, and now they've got a shot to go to Salt Lake City. They'll be on the ice when we return. Half of the Detroit Skating Club in Bloomfield Hills, Michigan. A warm welcome now for Stephanie Kalasavich and Aaron Parcha. Two spots available on the U.S. Olympic team for the pairs, and here is a team that's right in the thick of things. Stephanie Kalsavich and Aaron Parcham, the 2000 U.S. Junior Champions. Well, this is a big opportunity for them, and they have a very ambitious program planned. They are going to be side, doing side-by-side -side triple sow cows, which is a more difficult side-by-side -side jump than the triple toe loop. But they're opening with a throw triple sow cow, this back inside edge, watch her Lift it up into the air, very nice, tight in the air. Beautiful very landing precise. edge. Stephanie, 17 years old from the Detroit area. Aaron, 24 years of age from Chicago. They're well-matched skaters, good posture. These side-by-side -side triple sal cows, very difficult. Good, good. Well, well done. Oh, brother, I'll say. I mean, that's tough enough to do just by yourself, but have to do it with the unison of somebody else and adjust your timing to theirs is extremely difficult. Nice position. And this lift. They came in fourth at the Senior Nationals last season, but really got some great international experience this year. Part of the Grand Prix series. Very nice choreography to this music. Really interprets it very well. A little trouble on that side-by-side -side camel spin on his part. The unison is not very good in this. Simultaneous turning. That takes a great deal of maturity and experience. Good lift on that double twist. They are covering the ice really well. Good speed. Death spiral. She turns over into that back edge quite early in the in the death spiral. Their final move, a pair spin. You know, it was interesting to watch them through the program. They started off very strong, and then you saw that they, it just like it needs a little more time and a little more maturity. They are a very wonderfully potential pair in, in the sport of pair skating, and, you know, very much to be admired. They're good positions, they match well. Everything was very nice. Now, look at this magnificent throw, triple salkow. The height, the stretch, the close legs, the beautiful position of the landing, that was very fine. It's a little bit close to the boards there. And on these side-by-side -side triple salkows, again, the difficulty of this is extraordinary, particularly when you're doing it in connection with somebody else. There's a little cross foot on her part. Minor deduction, but really first rate. Look at how nice the back posture is on her part in this first picture here of the stroke motion of the split double twist. Again, as she steps into the air, splits, and then stretch her legs, tightly pointed toes, very nice set down at the end of this difficult move. And Aaron Fortune for required elements. 
Five and now two. the marks. Looks more on the left five side of your screen there, one of their coaches. Five Required five elements 5.0 five five to 5.5, the five point five point high mark. One. And those are very five acceptable two. in this championship. Five I mean, that, that was really a first-rate, uh, you know, performance. They're a young pair. They haven't had a lot of maturity, but as they gain that, it will really be, uh, they'll be a substantially important pair, I think. Hey, Dick, look at the presentation marks, all the way up to 5.8. Well, they're marvelous. They're really marvelous and, and very powerful. That side by side triple Salkows stood them in good stead. Mostly first place ordinals from the judges for Kalsavich and Parcham.